What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Let's do a little recap over yesterday's free pick. So I'm going to go ahead and pull up every play that we had in VIP yesterday. So let's go ahead and get this pulled up right here. You see, we had an amazing day in VIP. And actually, Roser's Chalk right here. And um, is there any more that I missed? No. Uh, Jones, I think, is going to cash. So I think we're going to have end up with like four X's total and like 20 checks, however many that is. So really good day. According to the free picks, we went two and two. Had Hoover and Howard, both over passing yards, both of those cash. Then we had Rozier and Brooks, both miss. So we had two PRA miss. The Rozier wagon comes to an end. We did sweep the board on sleeper. So we played five sleeper slips, all five cash. We had this one, Hoover, Howard, which obviously you guys saw in the free pick video. Cash, no, it wasn't Photoshop for the one that called me Photoshop. That's not Photoshop, man. Yes, we are. Uh, we have Hoover, Hoover, the on sale pick. We are VIP with Sleeper. When you play enough money on the app, you eventually get VIP. Same for prize picks. It allows you to play more on the discount. So I can do $75 discounts. It did cash for us. Cash this one right here. Grant and Holiday. Taylor and Taylor both cashed. Boston and Bet cashed. And then we had DiVincenzo and Mobley both cashed. Um, had, I actually played Donovan Evans and Levitt on uh, chalkboard. They cashed. I don't have the green slip because it showed a delay. But that cashed. And then uh, Lewis ended up cashing a 10x over on the better app, hundred dollars for hundred for a thousand dollars. Obviously, Thor had a good day. Charles had a good day. All the mods had a good day today too, man. It was a great day in VIP, and um, I just wanted to show some of those wins. But anyways, guys, I am going to go ahead and pick a winner from yesterday's video to get a free month of VIP. If this video gets a hundred and fifty likes, I'll pick a random comment down below to get a free month. So make sure you guys leave a like on the video, drop a comment. Let's pick our winner from yesterday's video. Winner is for. Legacy said, I'm rocking with you to the end, man. I appreciate you, Legacy, for real, dude. Appreciate the love and support from everybody, even on the bad days. Those two bad days came to an end, man. That's two good days in a row. Free picks in the last two days are five and three, which isn't amazing, but I'm um, still not terrible. The three and one day, two and two, I don't like. Um, but um, anyway, Legacy, send me a message on Discord, dude. I got you a free month of VIP. If you guys want to get every play we post, head on over to our Patreon or our WAP. Both of these platforms to send you to the same place, the paid section of our Discord. You can join our Discord for free. And um, we have a bunch of people in the chat always. You can ask questions, whatever you guys want to do. We'd love to have you a part of the community, whether you're in free or in VIP. But um, if you guys want VIP, the link is down there to get all of our plays. But anyways, guys, didn't forget to log into Prize Picks today. Cause thanks to, I'm going to go ahead and give you a shout out, man. <sighs> Rose too real, he said. Do not forget to sign on your phone and on your, I guess on your uh, computer is what he meant. But Rosa too real, appreciate you, dude, because I totally would have forgot today again, and uh, it's been driving me crazy because I can't click the props. But we got to pull it up now. I should have another 150 bucks coming in from the Prize Picks uh, promotion they did for boosting the server. 150 dollar promo sump funds coming our way. If you guys got in on that, congrats, because uh, not a, or I guess a lot of people did. Too many for them to keep doing the giveaway. But anyways, guys. Let's jump into these free picks for today. I will say if you guys, before we jump into these, one more thing. If you guys want a free month of VIP, you can sign up with any of our partnered apps. That's Better, Sleeper, Underdog, Parlay Play, Chalkboard. There's tons down in the, in the, in the bottom, DGF. Um, if you guys do want to sign up for Parlay Play or any of these apps, deposit $10 and let me know. Send me a screenshot. And I got you a free month of our VIP, and you're going to get a deposit match up to 100 bucks on every single app. So let's go ahead and jump in to these picks for today. So let's jump into our first pick of the day. It's going to be for our man Josh Allen, which I have pulled up here. I messed up and stopped recording by accident. So redoing this Josh Allen play. We got Josh Allen, Josh Allen over 242.5 passing yards. He is 237.5 on parlay play. So play him on parlay play if you want. 237.5. You actually get a higher payout on parlay play than you do on prize picks. But um, I did lock him in on prize picks as well at 242.5. I think he's going to cash both. But obviously, if you don't have parlay play, here's a good reason to join. We got the stats pulled up here already. Like I said, I messed up on the video. See, so he's only catched it three of eight games this season so far, average of 221 ish um, passing yards per game. He did catch it two of three games versus Miami. He has 272.5 or 0.67 uh, passing yards per game on average versus Miami. Miami does have a good pass defense, but I think Buffalo is going to have a good game tonight. I think Josh Allen's going to have a good game. I'm going on a whim here. I'm trusting my gut on this one. Obviously, they run the ball and pass the ball about 50 50, 51% pass the, uh, passing uh, rate. But um, I do like Josh Allen, man. I'm taking him over 242.5. I think he's cashing this line for us, and I've got him locked in versus Miami over 242.5 passing yards. So that is going to be pick number one of the day. Let's jump into pick number two. Pick number two is going to be for our man T. Lawrence. So taking Trevor Lawrence, and we're taking his passing yards as well, as well at 210.5. You can run the Goblin on either one of these. Obviously, I like the Goblin better in terms of uh, whether or not it's going to cash. And why does the, this little 
whatever you call it keep popping up. I don't know why it does that on, on computer now. or It does it on every single website for me, YouTube, whatever. But anyway, got that pulled. I got our old man, T, T. Lawrence, locked in at 210.5. See if he's actually discounted on, on uh, parlay play as well. So Trevor Lawrence. Uh, 209.5 with a higher payout. So you get a higher payout with T-Lo with T-Lo as well. 30 bucks would win you uh, $100. So instead of 90, you'd win 100.5, which is $10 more. So parlay play is way better right now in terms of value. So let's pull up T-Lo over here on um, outlier.bet. If you guys want a seven-day free trial of Outlier, use our link down in the description. And um, yeah, love the platform. Use it every single day, as I say in every video. But So T. Lawrence over 210.5. 209.5, you can see here, he's catching six of his last 10. He's catching four of eight games this season. He's averaging 230 passing yards per game. Looking at Philly, they have a pretty dang good passing defense. It is uh, it is 10th in the league at 193 passing yards per game. I think that the Jaguars are going to be trailing. I think he's going to have to air it out. Looking head-to-head, -head, there's no head-to-head -head data. But um, he's going to pass the ball 58% of the time. I don't know if... Is ETN out? ETN, let me see. He's questionable. So ETN is questionable this game. If he doesn't play, obviously that's going to make a T. Lawrence play even better. But even if T. If even if ETN plays, I think uh, T. Lo is still going to cash this. So got Trevor Lawrence over 209.5 passing yards locked in. If you guys want to tell, if you don't, you do not have to. But that is pick number two of the day. Before we jump into the next two, I have a shout out for DGF. If you guys don't know what DGF is, it is an optimizer. It's a tool. It takes every play that we play post or every play that is on any of the apps you play, pretty much like Prize Picks, Underdog, Sleeper. It takes all of them compared them directly to sports books and it gives you this percent odds to hit and a positive ev value so you can see you get lots of value here on dgf it does let you do something called a line discrepancy really really easy <clears throat> let me give you guys an example here <sighs> so cynics i guess i say his name over 27 and a half you can see other apps is 28 and 29 and a half so you take the over here on prize picks you're getting a point to two point discount it's 29 and a half on on hot street and they got it at minus 157 on hot street so if you get minus 157 odds for two points lower you get great value on prize picks that's one example of what you can do with dgf research the plays on here don't just blindly tell them but man i love this platform it is awesome they have something called the ai slip generator up here which you can see the ai slip generates up 2050 units in the last year people played 50 bucks on every single slip this gives you for the last year you built over a hundred thousand dollars profit so love the platform man use code aces on dgf you get 25 percent off the entire uh purchase and you get our vip for free take advantage of it now lock in dgf let's jump into these last two plays of the day so for the last two plays these are gonna be our two goblin plays i got two russian yard plays that i like a lot first one is gonna be for our man camara so taking alvin camara i got him locked in over uh 49.5 rushing yards which you got locked in right here um, I like this play a lot, man. Camara, they got New Orleans, or uh, yeah, the Saints playing against uh, Carolina, and uh, like this play a lot, man. So let's first check what it is on parlay play because parlay play has had better odds on every single play so far. <clears throat> I'm telling you guys, sign up for parlay play. So it is 49.5 on parlay play as well, 1.2x value, which is pretty low. We'll pull them up over here on uh, Outlier, Rush Yards. And then over 71 and a half is his original line. Come down here to 49 and a half. You can see you got Kendra Miller or Kendra Miller, I mean, who is uh who is out tonight, and then so is Jamal Williams. So both of these players are out. They do have uh Jordan Mims in the practice squad right now. That's been that's pretty much replaced the backup for Alvin Kamara for this game. So uh it's gonna leave more rush attempts for Kamara. Now they pass the ball 56% of the time. They're probably gonna throw the ball a little bit more because they're probably gonna have to. They're playing against Carolina. I don't think the Saints are gonna lose to Carolina. Honestly, it is at Carolina though, so who knows with the way NFL's been. Look at Carolina give up 31st in the league in rushing yards allowed. That's second to last. Then it's second to last versus running backs as well. 130 rushing yards per game. Kamara has 121 rush attempts on the season. <laughs> and he's cashed this in Five of eight games, which is uh, 63 rushing yards on average. So, love to play for Kamara. I've got him locked in. He catched both times versus Carolina. Lock in Kamara. If you like it, fade it. If you don't, that is pick number three of the day. Let's jump into our fourth final play of the day. And that is going to be for our man Robinson. So, we got Robinson over 49 and a half as well. And um, I like this play just as much as Kamara. Atlanta's playing against Dallas. Uh, my boy Ace and my brother are actually going to be at the Dallas game tomorrow. Unfortunately, I'm not able to go. I got to work. But, um, yeah, so got Robinson locked in. I am a Cowboys fan, but let's be honest here. Robinson's probably going to be able to get 50 yards tomorrow. 
tomorrow. But I'm um, looking at this 49 and a half. He's catching seven of his last 10, six of his last eight, averages 68 uh, running yard rushing yards per game. Looking at Dallas, 31st in the league in rushing yards allowed. Um, I'm pretty sure it just said that Carolina had the 31st, but um, regardless, maybe they're tied, but um. I don't think that's possible. Anyway, running backs, you can see they give up 23rd in the league at 109 per game. Robinson should be able to get it. They're going to throw the ball 58% of the time, so they're definitely going to pass the ball more than they throw the ball or more than they run the ball. I think it's going to be a close game. It could go either way. Once again, Robinson's going to get most of the carries. He's got 116 per game at 15, 56%. I like this play a lot, man, for our man Robinson, and I've got him over 49.5. Let's see what it is over here on parlay play. So you can get it at 55 and a half. So don't take that. Take, lock in the 49 and a half. But those are our four plays, guys. Better value on everything pretty much on parlay play. But I do have it locked in over here on prize picks as well. Josh Allen over 242.5 pass yards. T. Lowe over 210.5 pass yards. Alvin Kamara over 49 and a half rush yards. And then Robinson over 49 and a half rush yards as well. Lock them in if you like them. Fade them if you don't. Make sure you guys leave a like on this video. Drop a comment for your chance at free VIP. Sign up for any of our partner apps, like I said, to get a free month. Hope you guys have an awesome day. And I'll see you guys in the next video.